Hey YouTube, it's Paul Welford speaking. I've been asked to make this video, as this is my second ever video, on Kodi and the best um, sources you're going to need to see live football, films, um, TV series and things like that. And plenty more apart from that. As you can see, I'm using my iPad Pro 9.7 inch here, recording the screen onto my Mac. Um, you can see the bottom right hand corner, I've got Kodi. Um, I'm running at the moment um, 9.3.2, as you can see there, so there's no funny business. So it's not jailbroken or anything like that. Um, so, let's get started. So, once Kodi has been installed, and if you look at my last video, it will show you exactly how to put Kodi on any iOS device, including Apple TV 4, Apple TV 2, and Apple TV 1 as well. Okay, so if we open Kodi, if anyone's seen Kodi before, you know what it's like. This is um, uh, the front dash panel, if you call it that, so you can hold pictures, videos. We're going to add video add-ons. As you can see at the moment, I've obviously I've got none in there. It's empty. Um, so what I want you to do first of all to add the sources. To add the sources, you're going to scroll across to system. We're not going to click on system, otherwise this comes up. We don't want that to come up. We're just going to just so it's highlighted in blue. At the bottom, you've got option, you've got um, more tabs at the bottom. If you click on File Manager, on your left-hand side, we're looking at the right. Stick to the left-hand side. Um, you've got Profile Directories and Add Sources. We're going to add just two sources. But inside them sources, there's going to be quite a lot of um, video add-ons we can use. So if we click on Add Source, first thing, in the top bar where it says None at the moment, highlighted in blue, we're going to click on that again. And obviously you're going to get your keyboard or whatever else you're using. Um, we're going to start off by calling this source HTTP colon forward slash forward slash. And the first source we're going to add is the mega source. I like this source. It's got so much inside it and it's excellent to use. It's Fusion. Some of you may have already had this already. Fusion.tv add-ons. Dot ag. Some of what I'm going to pause it there, write down what I've actually done, um, and then come back to the video. So once you've done that, you click on done. And at the bottom, enter a name for this media source. We're going to call it Fusion, because that's the source we're going to add on you. Yeah? So we're going to call it Fusion and push done again. Push OK. And as you see on the left hand side at the top, we've got our first source, Fusion. Now let's add our second source exactly the same way. We're going to click on Add Source. Same again. Click on None. Let's put um, the tab at the top. Um, this source is started off the same way. HTTP colon forward slash forward slash um, repo. Copy exactly the same. No capital letters. Let's put them in there. Dot Docky TV Dot NL. Dot NL is just from like the Netherlands. Click done on that. Come down to enter name for media source. We can just call it Doki so we know which one we're looking for. So I've got Doki. Push done and push OK. Now on the left hand side we've got our sources. What we're going to need to do is at the bottom come back to our home button. So back at the home. This time Instead of highlighting it in blue, system, we're going to click on system itself. So it will bring up this page. And if you scroll all the way down to the bottom, oops, excuse my big fingers, scroll down all the way to the bottom, you see add ons, third from bottom, yeah? So click on add ons. Now, from here, take care, we're going to actually install from zip file. So click on install from zip file. As you can see, the top two are our sources that were actually added. Docky and Fusion. Let's click on Docky first and click on the repository. If you click on here, and you look at the bottom right hand corner of the screen, you'll see Docky repository added, enabled. We'll let that go away first before you do anything else. That's gone now. Now we're going to add um, install, no, sorry, install from zip file again. Go to Fusion. This one's a bit difficult, so you have to keep watching now. And click on XBMC repos. Then we're going to click on English, and there's loads of um, repositories inside here. The ones we're going to need, if you want films, if you look at the bottom, 
it's got one called Exodus. That's the first one we're going to grab. So click on Exodus. Look at the bottom right again, you'll see Exodus repository has been added and let it update itself, it updates to the latest um, Exodus. Again, we're gonna get, it's gonna be quite repetitive, but we're gonna get all the sources we need before we can actually show you what they actually do inside. So we're gonna install from zip file again, Fusion, XBMC repos, English, and if we scroll down on the right hand side, there's a little scroll thing we can actually use. Um, we're gonna get Goliath. So if you see a repository Goliath 1.0.0.1, uh, click on that. This is a mega one. It's only newly added, so there's a lot of new stuff on here that I've not even ventured into yet. So once that's done, again, same format. Install from zip file, Fusion, XPMP repos, English. Scroll down. The next one we want will be MD repos, Mighty Duck repos. They've got a lot of football added stuff on here, so that'd be quite a good one for most people. So Mighty Duck repos, MD repos. Let that update itself. Okay, same again, there's quite a few we're gonna get from Fusion. Fusion, XPMP repos, English. Scroll down again. This time we're gonna want, uh, should we get the metal kettle from here? Uh, no, let's leave that one. Let's go on to Podgod, which is, a, from bottom at the moment as we look at it podgod.1.7 we're going to get that that's got a lot of football a lot of sports if you're into the sky sports and stuff like that it's got that stuff on there one more look in fusion again experience impose english scroll to the bottom and there is one we're going to need there we go, it's near enough at the bottom, well it's about full from bottom if you go all the way to the bottom. It's XBMC Hub. We're going to need that. Right, we've got all the add-ons zipped onto our device. One thing we're going to do first is install from repository, so it's just the one above. We're going to click on that. And the first um, repository we're going to add is Exodus. Just because it's easy to do. Click on Exodus repository. Then go to video add-ons. So all the stuff I click on to, you need to go into video add-ons every single time. And there's Exodus. That's one. You can't really make mistakes on that one. Click on this one. It says install. Highlighted in blue straight away for you. Click install. Wait for a little while. So you're downloading next to it. It's pretty quick sometimes, depending on the servers. But try and make sure you're connected to the internet. Would be actually handy. There we go. It's been enabled on the bottom right hand side. Wait till that's gone away before you do anything else, just in case it makes an error. Okay, that's gone. Now on the bottom bottom right of the screen, you click on the arrow backwards, back again. And now we're going to go to um, Docky TV repositories. Click on that one. Again, straight to the bottom, down to video add-ons. Now we're going to get quite a few from here. This is all your sports, your football. My favourite, obviously, I'm a football fan. Um, first one we're going to get is NL View at the top. We don't actually need the repository, but it opens something else and it gives us something. So install. Let it, down, let it install at the moment, it's just downloading. I'm doing this all live time, I'm not just going to speed any of this up, I'm just going to let it go. As you see, add on, enabled. There we go, that's one done. Also now, we're going to click on DocuTube. Do we need? No, we don't need that one for now. Go down to Brett Streams. This is a newly added stream. We get with football again. There's been a lot of these for football. Let this enable. That's done. Okay, we're going to the Elite Sports. I love this one as well. It's really good. Premiership. Um, anywhere really. You can get any sort of football on this. We're going, to, we're going to grab Money Sports while we're here as well. That one shouldn't be too long. Yeah, that's a quick one as well. Again, you can get, as you can see, you can get all sports, football, basketball, American football, cricket, whatever you like on that one. This is my favourite, Sports Devil. It always works for me normally. I always find a stream that I like. So let's install that one while we're here. Again, if I want to show you these, any of these in depth, I will do afterwards. At the moment, I'm going to show you how to add them and where you're going to find them afterwards when you need them. 
Um, I think in that one now, um, let's get uh, FM. I mean F four M Testo as well, because that can help with some of the streams which can't be located. It helps system find the streams for you. Okay, once that's done, we'll go back again. The bottom right, um, back again. And there you go. See the NL view? We've just, we've just added that. Inside here, go into video add-ons. And now there's one called Salts Salt HD Lite. Second from bottom there. Click on that one. We want to go install that one. Okay, I think that's all we're going to get from there. Come back out again twice, and as you can see, it's given us another repo, which is XVBMC. Inside there, and then go to video add-ons. There's more sports. I'm giving you all the sports I can possibly give you at the moment. We're going to click on S Salts, same thing as HD Light, but Salts RD Light, which is covers every sport you could ever possibly imagine. So you've got both sports channels there. Okay, once that's done. Okay, we go back and back again. And now we want to find one called Popcorn. So if we go to all repositories at the top, that will give us every repository we have on the device. Go to Video Add-ons. There we go. So what we're going to enable now, if we scroll all the way down to get to some um, to get to P, something called Phoenix. A lot of people may know this one as you know, everyone had Phoenix back in the time. There it is. Install that. Okay, and I think that is everything now. Everything that we could possibly want for sports. Okay, click home button on the home button. Now, I'm going to go back into system quickly, back into add ons, go back. Go back, and we're going to have to um, install Goliath. If you go to Goliath add-ons, repos, video add-ons, and evolve. This is going to have so much inside that you're going to use the TV, all sorts of stuff inside there. Sorry, I had to go backwards there. I just forgot about this one. This is quite important one to have. It says you're saying I'm doing so many at once, so I'm gonna hopefully not forget any. Um, done all those, we've done those ones. Okay, that's great. So go back to the home button. Sorry, this is where we're meant to go back to the home button. Now I'm gonna scroll straight away across to videos. Make sure it's highlighted, and then click on add-ons. There is all the add-ons we actually added have added. Click on the thing on the pad on the side and view info is at the top. If you keep clicking on that. It will make it into um, squares. It's be much easier to actually deal with. There we go. So these are all the stuff we're going to use. I mean, I can show you quickly if you want me to. Let's go for Exodus if you want to film. Exodus is the place to go. Definitely the place to go. We've got different um, titles here. We've got movies, TV shows, channels, my list, latest movies, latest episodes. So again, you can get all your episodes from, I don't know, um, Lost or whatever you used to watch on TV. I'm not a big, big TV fan. But yeah, Game of Thrones, that would all be in there. Um, if you go to movies, just a quick show for someone. Um, let's go for most popular, just because it's there. Just to show you, you know, some of the streams are pretty good. There you go. So if you want films, got Deadpool, stuff like that. If I click on one just to show you how it starts up, hoping it starts, because you know, you never know when the stream's going to be on. Click on it once, give it time. Depends on your connection and whatever else. Um, it should come up. I mean, it looks good so far, but sometimes they do foul. But more than likely, Exodus is pretty good. There we go. There's all the HT streams. Obviously, the ones at the top are all HD, so I always go from the top first. Click on that first. Uh, to watch this device, when you visit, visit. Oh, if you hold down, if you've got an iPad Pro like me, where it says HTTP QWE dot AS, if you hold down on that and let go. It should, in theory, 
There we go. Second time of asking. Play your film. And as you can see, quality is pretty good. Let's see if I can fast forward it a bit just to get. There we go. And we have sound at the moment. I've got the sound down on the actual system itself, but yeah, it's got sound, it's got everything else on it. Let's see if I can put the sound up a little bit. No. Um, okay, well, I can't get the sound because. Oh, here we go. Yeah, it's got full sound at the moment. I'm plugged in through my Mac, so I don't think the Mac's got too much sound going on. Anyway, as you can see, quality is brilliant. It's second to none. Again, push stop, go back, back a step. Let's just show you some sports while we're here. I'm always going depth in these, I'll go in depth even more. Let's go Sports Devil, one of my favourites. Now, if you want live sports, always go straight to live sports, right in the middle there. And these will be the, um, streams that you can find. First row, oh, I normally use first row sports. That's my own one. Football, because I like football. And at the moment, I think there's a match going on, Portugal and Iceland, uh, as we speak, and Portugal winding up, by the way. Okay, um, so there's all the links. I mean, they're not all going to work, but again, click on the one that doesn't work, go to the next one, go to the next one. Oh, there we go. There's a string straight away. It's not bad, is it? Okay, okay, thanks for your listening. But um, if you've got any questions, please leave them down below because obviously it's my second ever video. I may have skipped something, I may have went too fast. In the description below, I'll leave all the sources you're going to need and the link back to my other video if you haven't got Cody on your device. Okay, thanks for coming. Um, please leave a like rating. Obviously, if you don't like it, then please leave a negative rating. It's fine. Um, thanks for your listening. Thanks, bye.